So number 10, 2019, paper one, we are told, Atuari is converted mm. uh, 5,820 US dollars into Kenyan shillings at a rate of Kenyan shillings 102.10 cents per dollar. Uh, while in Kenya, he spent 450,000 Kenyan shillings and converted the balance into dollars at the rate of uh, 103.00 per dollar. Calculate the amount of money to the nearest dollar that remained. You get yourself three marks. So this you run in commercial arithmetic one in form one and just to remind ourselves when you are converting currency when you are changing to, K to the local currency since this is done in the bank or forex bureau uh, the, you are, you are, your dollar or you are value in this case a dollar is multiplied at a, at a lower value compared to the value that you said uh, that is you change and this the difference is a is a profit that the bank uh, or the forex bureau makes out of the exchange of money because it is business so with that if he had five thousand and twenty eight uh five thousand eight hundred and twenty do us dollars to convert, you need to multiply uh, the dollars 5,820. You multiply by the exchange rate, which is 102.10 Kenyan shillings. When you multiply that, this should give you uh, this should give you uh, 594. 222 Kenyan shillings. Uh, while in Kenya, uh, he spent 450,000 in Kenya. So this means that uh, by the time he was to leave, he, he had a balance of uh, 2 2. You subtract this is 4. Uh, this is 4. Uh, that is 140. 4222 Kenyan shillings and because he's back going back to the country to his to his country let's say if it is uh, United States of America he cannot go with the Kenyan money so you have to change and now to change uh, you divide at a higher value so that the difference is what the the, the, the bank or the Forex Bureau will make profit so you divide uh, the amount that uh, he had one thousand uh, one thousand one hundred thousand and forty four thousand two hundred and twenty two you divide by the change value change which is one or three point zero zero and using your calculator when you divide you should get uh, uh, dollars this is a sign for dollar uh, one thousand four hundred and uh, one thousand four hundred and this is to the nearest uh, a dollar, uh, so that is what you get, and that is the uh, amount of uh, money in the form of dollar that you go with back to his country. So that's how you work out that question.